Jo, what up, what up, what up? This is Busy Home Beat with your boy King Series. Yeah, and in today's video, I'm just going to talk to you about how to fix this kind of problem. Yeah, and long story short, I did um change my system unit almost one week ago, and um, um I did install FL Studio 20.8.3. Yes, on it. Um, and this was the kind of problem that I was facing. I didn't know how to fix it. I tried my possible best watching videos and everything, but still, but I think I've really had um, have um, a solution to this kind of thing. If you are having the same problem here, I'm just going to show you how to do it. Yes. And please, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe to support your boy. Like and comment to this video because your time will never be wasted watching this video. Yes. So the, ne the thing that I really, there, there are two solutions over here. The first one is, I think, um not exactly two solutions i will see maybe three solutions yes so the first one is is either you change your um windows because this windows 11 that i'm using yes it's either you change it from windows 11 and um, windows 10 back to windows 8.1 or windows 8 for there when you i did install windows 8 and windows 8.1 and um, i was not having this kind of problem but i didn't want to use the windows 8 and 8.1 I wanted uh, windows 10 or windows 11 i did install windows 10 and th this problem started coming i changed from this uh, windows 10 to windows 11 and still i'm having this kind of problem so if um, you are having this kind of problem the first solution is easy that you change from windows 10 and 11 towards um windows 8.1 or windows 8 that one you wouldn't have any problem there but if you are still having the problem the next one is um i think your graphics card yes your graphics card so if you your graphics card is uh, your graphics card is really down you really have to upgrade it so that you can get some you can get some kind of good graphics over then it will help you out yes it will help you out and the next one the last one that if you don't have you don't want to change from your windows and everything the next one is um this is what you really have to do so that um this kind of problem that you are having and whenever you just put a plug in there you are not just going to have this kind of error so what you have to do is um the plugin that you are putting in for example i'm using i'm putting um, i'm trying to insect uh, nexus so that i can play my beat over here but that's what i'm having now nexus is 32 bit um plugin right yes it's 32 bit plugin so and the fl studio that i've opened over here is 64 bit so if i'm supposed to um click ok to exit this one whenever you install um fl studio the icon that appears on your desktop here yes this one is 64 bit this one is 64 bit so on that one when you open the nexus it's not going to come so if you really want to use your windows together with everything here so that your nexus will open or your plugin that you are trying to open in this 64 bit and the icon on the screen here is not um i mean showing up what you really need to do is um you just have to move back to fl studio the 34 bit then open it where can you find this kind of fl studio 34 bit you just have to um open this pc or my computer or yes so for windows 11 is this pc then you move to um local dc this part is where the 32 bit plugins are really installed but we have to move to 64 because FL Studio 20.8 is 64 bit. Then we move to um image line. You look for image line, image line. Yes, this image line. Then you move to FL Studio 20 here. Then you look for you can see that this is my FL. Yes, this is the 64, 64 bit, right? So you just have to open your 32. This is the 32 bit plugin. So let me just close it. So you just have to open your 32 bit but because i really want um uh yeah i really want this thing to be there for me so that i wouldn't be coming here and opening it each, each and every day um i just have to pin this one to my tax bar here so this the 32 bit here on my tax bar and this the 64 bit on my screen the icons so if i'm supposed to open this one or this it's still the same thing here so this is fl studio this is the 32 bit but it's still the same as fl studio 20.83 so now let me try and load my nexus again and see what happens next 
so you can see that now i'm having my nexus there right yes so there is it and you can still load um other plugins let me load my purity tool in here um it's going to open but if you open them in the 64 bit um it's not going to open for you because of maybe your windows or your um what do we call it your graphics so is either you change your graphics and still open in the 64 bit or you change your windows to 8.1 and 8 if you have still having the problem then you just have to go by this method so that's the solution that i have really um gotten and i just wanted to share with you guys so try it for yourself if you like my video make sure you thumbs up and uh, comment to this video and also subscribe to this channel to support your boy i hope your time was never wasted it's your boy king series yes i'm out